So I'm just going to show you how to download and install R and R Studio. So we go to the R project. So what we need to do is we go to download R. So we go to this page here and then you just go to your country. So in the UK. So it doesn't really matter which one of these you choose. We'll go to Imperial here and then we've got our different downloads and installs so depending on what operating system that you're working on so you go to download R for Windows then install R for the first time download R for Windows then you've got installation other instructions new features of this version and so on you may wish to read that information but here's your R file getting downloaded here Then we just need to run it. You get a choice of language. The installation guide. You need to be an administrator when you're installing it. There's your information there. You will all read that in great detail. Click next. Where you're going to download it to. Accept the defaults. And that's just your about your program shortcuts in your menu folder leave everything as default you can create a desktop shortcut and so on if you want I actually wouldn't bother doing so because we won't be using R directly we use R studio click next and then it will install it for us there we go and finish and we've now installed R however what we need to do get R studio as well so we just go to products and R studio there is different versions of things. We want our R Studio desktop and we want our free version. Of course, you may have some money and licenses for so on for all this, but we just go to download our Studio desktop. So we just want to download that. And then we just click download our Studio. So once you open this, this does our R Studio setup, and we can just set up all this with our default, and then click install, and that will install our Studio onto your computer. Come on, finish. Now we can get. Our studio there, our app appears. And here is our, our stu studio open there. We have some different windows here. You can see there's only one window here, and this is the our console, which is actually will where you run your stats and it produces your output and so on. However, we can do a new R script and this opens here, and this is actually where we do all our substantial work here as part of the R script, so you write the scripts here and it'll produce the output down in the console. And we can save these scripts and here we can install some packages. I'll do another session on packages and our plots will appear and so on. We can, you know, we can remove these, make them small, make them larger and so on. But yeah, as I say, this is where we do our substantive work and we'll be covering most of what we cover will be in this area. However, that's how you download and install both R and our studio.